We all know for his role as Vision in the Avengers movies. Now he is playing the superhero again in the new TV show WandaVision. Paul Bettany, thank you for being with us this morning. We appreciate it. So let's start with some happy news. We understand that you got a puppy during quarantine, but possibly stirring up some feelings of jealousy in the house. Tell us how it's going. <laughs> Yes, we got a pandemic puppy by mistake, um, and the puppy gets very jealous if I ever try and hug my Aww. wife. In, in fairness, in <laughs> fairness, though, I get really jealous if the puppy hugs my wife. So I, 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 I guess all's fair in love and war. <laughs> That's why they call it puppy love. Yeah, gets to be gets in between the other loves. And we're gonna talk about WandaVision. And in your, in your new show, you play Vision, and then there's Wanda Maximoff. And you're moving through the decades um, through different American sitcoms. And it starts in the 50s, but you say the action really picks up as it goes through, as the decades unfold. Yeah, that's right. I mean, uh, it, 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 we, we start in sitcom land and we hurtle through the 20th century at breakneck speed and then Vision begins to realize something can't be right in this town. Um, but, um, you know, the real world and, and this world are on a collision course and uh, in, in fact there were more special effects requirements for this show than for Endgame. So, wow. Um, oh, wow, wow. It's going to get big. It is. It's so creative. And the first episode is done in Dick Van Dyke show style. You really, you nail his mannerisms. Did you, did you study him beforehand? I did, yeah. I, I mean, I, I, even though I grew up in London in the United Kingdom, I, I grew up on those shows, Saturday mornings and Sunday mornings after church but before sports were given over to uh, the, you know, Dick Van Dyke show, the I Love Lucy, uh, you know, I mean, it was, so So I was really familiar with them, but um, I, I must have watched every Dick Van Dyke uh, show episode that, that was made uh, for this, so. It yeah. shows. I stole it, It shows, it shows. No, 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 you own it, you own it. And in fact, I think we have a clip for everybody oh, to take yeah. a look at. Wonder. <laughs> Is there something special about today? Well, I know the apron is a bit much, dear, but I am doing my best to blend in. No, no, there on the calendar, someone's drawn a little heart right above today's date. Oh, yes, the heart. Hmm. <laughs> well, don't tell me you have forgotten, Viz. Forgotten? I wonder. I'm incapable of forgetfulness. I remember everything. That's not an exaggeration. In fact, I'm incapable of exaggeration. Well, then tell me what's so important about today's date. What was the question again? <laughs> <laughs> and, and Paul, you may know that we had your co-star Elizabeth Olsen on earlier this mm. week. I'm bracing myself for the answer to this, oh but I feel like it's only fair. We are fair here on GMA. She told her side of the story of Snotgate. Now it's your <clears> turn. <throat> yes, I, I really relish the opportunity to come on your show and thwart what I think we can all agree would be a gross miscarriage of justice. <laughs> um, during a kissing scene, which is in the trailer where everything goes into color, snot appeared on both our lips, which is, of course, disgusting. Um, I was a gentleman and kind of went away and just sort of pretended it hadn't happened. And she rather grumpily pointed the finger at me. <laughs> but, but I can prove categorically that it was her snot, not my snot. <laughs> if, if Elizabeth Olsen were here today, or Elizabeth Snotter Olsen, as I think oh, we can refer to her from, from now on. If she were here today, she would tell you, she would be the first to tell you that when she gets emotional in a scene, her nose runs before uh, the tears come, mm. whereas I'm English and uh, preternaturally unable to express emotion. So, uh, the, you know, the, the, the counsel for the prosecution rests. <laughs> yeah, that was some incriminating evidence you had I there, mean, Paul. That was pretty good, Told Paul. I, I got to give you that. All right, Paul Bedney, thank you so much for oh. being with us. We really appreciate it. It is fantastic to have you here in WandaVision, premiering Friday exclusively on Dinger... Ginger. Oh my God, Disney Plus, and now we're going to Ginger. Ginger, save me I from myself. That. Yeah, it's all right. I was I was following Booger Gate really closely too, so I know I know that was confusing. <laughs> Thank you, Amy. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching.
and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.